All right, this is the controller modification for the DEF dispensing. You can see the controller says uh, press Y to use DEF. Um, this is what's going to go on the truck up next to the DEF hose. And uh, so if I'm going to make a delivery, uh, it'll ask me to enter a customer number. Let's just say customer 55. Uh, and then if I'm going into a truck, it might want to track each individual truck number, so I'm going to put it into truck 123. And then uh, it's ready. It says get a customer 55 it went to truck 123. Yes to begin. So now uh, you can hear it pumping. That's all simulated. Uh, it would now be turning on the DEF pump. I go over and squirt as much in with the nozzle. It records it on the screen. Uh, when I'm done with that truck, I can uh, press in and say, yes, I'm going to do another truck. Or if I had stopped pumping after 30 seconds of no pulses, it would have automatically assumed I was uh, at this point and asked me if I have another truck. So I'm still at customer 55. I'm going to say, yes, let's do another truck. And uh, this is truck uh, 698. Yes. And... Uh, Yes to begin. So now I'm selling DEF into another truck. And uh, let's say I'm done with that truck. And uh, now I'm, I'm so let's say I'm done with that customer. So another truck is no. And at this point, it has recorded those deliveries onto the flash drive. Uh, and that's the DEF cycle. If I'm going to deliver DEF, without truck numbers, let's say customer number 89, enter a truck number, I can just put zero or something like that, ignore that truck number, and uh, it, it doesn't make any judgments as to your entries of customer or truck numbers, it just takes whatever you put in. So it's really just a, a way to record the deliveries, it's not making any correlation with actual customer numbers. It will record actual dates and times in actual gallons. There's also a calibration process for the DEF meter, which I'm not going to go into here. It's, it's the same process as the additive meter. So this is what's going to be up next to the DEF pump. On the back of the truck is going to be the remote screen, which has been running here all along. And it only shows additive stuff. So. I'm not going to show you, well, never mind. So this is the additive. I'm going to turn on the additive dispensing, and you'll see now it says the unit is ejecting. If I go back to the controller at this point, it says system is injecting. It's the other screen. And so this is what's going to go at the back of the truck, and this is what's going to go at the... Uh, def area. As soon as I stop injecting, it records that and we're back to being able to do DEF or additive. You can do one or the other but not at the same time. Uh, so if this looks okay, that's what we'll go with.